One of them is, well, you don't know about them. That's okay. You, you, know, you can still testify on the main part of the bill. And uh, it wouldn't be in the first place, but at least we know what part of the bill, what form of the bill you're testifying on. Okay. Because Thanks. Because things can happen pretty, pretty quickly, although most amendments are out well in advance of a, uh, of a committee meeting. I think this, this system we're moving to will improve it. Uh, I don't know. Probably I guess you're going to have you're going to have you're going to have the same information on the table. <coughs> so there's no legislative route for I know the secret handshake. Well, my whole point was just for us to be prepared to understand all this different stuff that we're going to be trying to look on the internet. We're going to be prepared for one thing, but even with all this. There might be something last minute that's put on the actual paper that we end up seeing there that could be different. And this is an all new program we're just putting into place about the day we open the legislature, which is very helpful. Right. Uh, <laughs> and you know there's going to be bugs in it. So. I, 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 would, I would suggest because you guys are all close, right? And you may in fact for testimony. I would suggest that if your bill is related to the following topics, that you, be prepared, you anticipate that there'll be instantaneous changes if you're going to testify sitting in the committee room. Those committees being environment, judiciary, health, what, what, on the Senate side, what do we call it? I don't know. We call it the health committee. What, on the Senate health side, human services. health and human services on the Senate mm -hmm. side. Um, yeah, those three, I'm thinking around the room here. Yeah, those three and rules. You should anticipate that you will not see in advance what is going to happen and that you should be prepared to be flexible in your testimony. Thank you. I just know from personal experience and discussions of the last week that you should anticipate that those are. Likewise, on the opposite side, as I'm trying to think here, I, I think in rural development, which is chaired by Arnie Roblin, I think by transportation by Lee Beyer, I think veterans by myself, um, that you should anticipate um, that everything will be out. The area that's going to be problematic